what's up guys uh, create tutorials here with a new tutorial for you guys <clears throat> in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you like a twitch transition um, yeah and there was a guy who requested but I can't remember him his name but it's a uh, twitch transition effect uh, looks pretty good uh, so yeah this is the effect looks pretty goddamn awesome actually yeah uh, so yeah let's make it so I will just uh, do like that take away all the effects okay so now what we have is just uh, this layer basically so what you first want to do is just add in a twitch from video video compilot and just go to your clip like where the first clip ends and the first clip starts where the second clip starts this yeah it's there uh, let me see here there yeah um then you uh, just wanna go and click it click down mount uh, keyframe and you wanna drop it down to about 40 45 on there and you wanna put the speed to hmm around 25 I think it was and then go to the enable tab and make it or check the slide and light and color and you can go to the operator controls whatever go to the slide menu and go to the slide RBG, RGB split and turn this up and you get this like colors in it can use this but I don't like using that but whatever so if we could click you on our keyboard we have a keyframe right here now we just wanna go about one sec like a little less than a sec and make it a zero and then go back to the spot and then go like a second again and then make it zero again highlight the keyframes Okay guys, right click keyframe assistant assistant uh ECs. So you wanna highlight them right click keyframe assistant, yeah whatever. Uh okay, and then you make sure you have the click this motion blur thingy and then click make sure you click this too. If you don't have this selected but this selected then it will not make any things like changes uh, so um, to make it like more realistic like more it has more blurring you can just uh, add a real smart motion blur less, like the last tutorial uh, real smart motion blur yes drag that in and leave it leave it as 0 0.50 in the blur amount looks really good actually uh, I wish I could ramp here but I'm rendering a tutorial right now oh shit <laughs> I'm rendering a tutorial right now so it will go really slow but I can try um, but yeah guys that all as always leave a like and a comment below it motivates me like so much more you can't even imagine how much it motivates me if if I get like 10 to 15 likes and like 10 comments I would like uh, uh, yeah it makes me so happy if I see that if I see like five likes and one comment then then I yeah it's not fun anymore then so be sure to leave some 
feedback to me guys and uh, yeah as always request tutorials below also uh, what tutorials you want to see and stuff like that <coughs> so this will just render render out soon this is a really quick effect it's, it's nothing hard to do really it's really easy uh, and you can use this like effect after when you shoot but I already made a tutorial for that so huh. okay it's done now so this is the effect so looks really good actually yep so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and be sure to leave a like and a comment below uh, as I said earlier and bye guys